Alright, hi guys, I'm just back again. I'm pretty bored, so I'm just chilling out and I thought I'd make a video. So, I am just, I just was looking around my room and I suddenly found this. The Australian Mini Oxford Dictionary. Yeah. Um, so, I found this and just having a look at it and... I'm just gonna rate it because from mine, like the words, if I like, you could see that properly, but if I zoom out, like you can hardly see it. So, like when I look at it, I can barely see it. So, very interesting for that. So, I would give this one a three because it's got like, it's so like eight fit, fit your pocket, but like the words just don't seem to fit in there. Um, yeah, alright, up to the second thing. Um, squishy toy. Uh, I, I'd give this a four. Just that, well, I love them because they're squishy and what I don't like about them is when I, the one that I, like, I rated a four, but... The why, why I didn't rate it a five is like once you play with it for a long time, the orbies inside it get all mushed and then you can't play with it anymore. I've had to chuck out most of mine. And it leaks if you squeeze it too hard, apparently. Okay. Third thing. Um, The third thing is probably going to be Flop. Let's bounce around. It's a little old. But I love flop. And still going to give it a five because it's not that stretchy. But then, yeah, it's very old. Um, but then, it's not that stretchy. But then, when you put it in the where it's supposed to go, and you squeeze it. Makes funny, oh, that one's a big one. Makes funny noises and give that a five because I love that type of things. Fourth thing, um, this thing got jelly beans in it, so as you can see, it's it's like a jelly bean bunny thing. So if I wind it up here. I just felt it. No, it's not stuck. Oh, it's, yeah, that's all. That's totally disgusting. But, okay, I, I'd definitely rate that one. I think I left those uh, in there for a long time. All right, fifth thing I'm guessing, I don't know what I'm up to because I'm not even counting. Uh... Smiggle, well, not just Smiggle, just notepads. Well, I've got quite a couple. I've got this one here. I've got sticky notes, so like any notepad. And I've also got this little booklet thing. So, I honestly think that these are awesome because I like how they've always been set out in like a cute and funny way. I think they're awesome because really interesting, fun, and you can just like write your notes on them. All right, let's go to the next thing. Stretchy snake. Uh, as you can see, you'll see the fluff on it. It's very old. I just found it today. So you can see it here. It's got a long tongue and yeah, it's really stretchy. I give it a four, maybe, no, actually maybe a three. 
Oh no, what happened there? All right, uh, I give it a three because what I hate about them is sometimes they're too sticky. They get fluff on them and they just and they also get stuck in your they can get stuck in your hair. I had a doll and it got stuck in the doll's hair, so I don't like them. All right, one of my favorites, blue tack. You probably don't know what blue tack is if you haven't experienced it yet, but I'm pretty sure you have. But if you didn't, blue tack is like something that you can like stick. No, oh, this is just some random picture. Made out of the word princess. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so if you grab a little bit off, you can put it and then stick it on the camera. <laughs> you can stick it like, like that. So it stays. And I'll stick it on the bunny thing just so you can see. So you can stick it like that. And that's what's really cool about it. I'm definitely giving this a five. But I have nothing really to say about these when they're bad. Nothing really to say about them when they're bad. Because if I say something like that they're bad, it'd probably just like think, oh, you're crazy, bear. Uh, so they're really good. I'm not going to go over the top of how they're really bad because they're, they're very unfortunate things. All right. Uh, like novelty lip balms. Now, this one's one of my favorites because it looks cute. And then when you open it, it's really cute too. Just really cute. And they smell really nice. So... I'd probably give them a four. Sometimes I just don't like them because either the lip balm is when it's really hot, the lip balm melts and it gets really bad and it jams up the bottle. Well, that's just what happens with me. All right. Then one of my favorites. Another one of my favorites. Uh, little tiny erasers. I've got heaps of them. Yeah, this is my set of them. Right there. So. Oh, I've got two grapes. I didn't know that. They look like blueberries, but. Oh, and there's one more. Must have missed it. So I like these because they scent. They're very old. They don't really have any scent anymore, but that's one downside. They scent and they're very adorable and you can actually use them. But sometimes when you get novelty erasers and like things, they, they look really pretty, but sometimes they don't actually work. Like... This one here, it's a lipstick. Hang on, let me just chuck them out of there. It's a lipstick uh, eraser. You open it, then you can twist it. But this angle, you can't actually erase it. I've tried erasing with it before. They're really cool to have, but they break easily. I've just done it up with washi tape and still works, but they break really easily. All right, I'm just going to put all these things back they took out. There we go. All right. Next is my... All right, let me think now. Sorry. Can't think. Um, oh, keychains. Yes. Keychains. Oh, I, I forgot to write that one. Ah, uh, three. <laughs> All right, so this is my keychain. Really cool, it's a Lego person. And I like them, I give them a five because they're really cool keychains. They have all the details and they don't break apart. So like, 
let's say you're just walking and then the body falls off and you can't find it again and all you have on your keychain is a head yeah so that's why i like them i'm gonna give them a five all right we've got quite a couple to get through now all right diy toys well this is uh, i made a whole set of these I, I could actually show you how to make them you can't it's very messy um they're very cool because i've made a whole ton of them like this one this one this one made a whole ton of them and they're very fun and cool to use like i made a, all of them and i like them because sometimes when i do diys they're very useful they're not just pieces that you're never going to use again like i use them quite a lot and they're very useful to me all right next um oh oh five for them next is uh these little bead things i made a palm tree out of them i'll just go get them hang on just excuse me for this so yeah oh sorry about this all right they got them so they come in a bucket now they're basically water reacted so i just go get some oops that was a blooper don't mind that so i'll just grab two blues oh i just need to clean this up i got two blues and i'll make i'll make something quickly with you while i'm doing this all right so i've got two dark blues i don't know what they are purple i don't know no they're I don't know. I'll just use the light blues. Alright. Light blues here. So if I just quickly put some water on this one. Got water bottle. Alright. Just put a tiny bit of water on it. Now don't put too much because they get really bad. And they've got, oh no, I dropped it. Alright. Still got it. So if you stick them together when they've got water. They stick. You can make something out of it. I'm going to make... Hmm, what can I make with blue? Um, I will make... I don't know. Um, Alright, let's just leave it there. Because there's something else. I just picked up that. Alright. Now, one of my favourites is also is uh, little bangle things. I like them because, see this one? It's got like these really nice things on it. I like them because you can wear them, they're easy to wear, and they're no stress. Alright, now this is the last thing. Uh, I said there's a lot to go through, but I actually don't know where the other stuff has gone. I'm very... That was a big mistake for me. All right, erasers. I love erasers. Like I showed you before, the novelty erasers. I've got heaps, maybe 50 of them. They're just so cool. I love them. I want to show you a razor magic trick. Alright. Razor magic trick. Magical magic. I like them because I make a lot of mistakes and they're really good hanger. Alright, let me get all the little cards. Alright, so I'm going to put these cards. Spin them around. I honestly do not know which one is which now. All right. Oh, magical magic one. All right. So I'll put it in the slot. Oh, stop. All right. 
Now, if you have one of these at home, you'll probably know the magic trick. All right, shake it up. Shake it up, shake it up, shake it up. All right, I've shaked it. All right, I hope I still know how to do this. It's gone! <laughs> All right, this is busted. All right, so that is that thing. Now, thank you for watching. Um, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!